Welcome back to Underwater Math. We are going to be representing multi-step problems using equations today. Let's get started. I have great news. It's book fair day. And Ivy can't wait to get new books. Ivy bought three graphic novels and four chapter books. Write a set of equations that can be used to find M, the amount of money Ivy spent on books. Graphic novels cost $12 each and chapter books cost $10 each. To find the total cost of her books, the equations we need will be the cost of the graphic novels, the cost of the chapter books, and the sum of the two. Let's start with the graphic novels. These are $12 each and we need three of them, so our first equation will be using multiplication. Three groups of $12 is $36. For the chapter books, we have four of them, at $10 each. So our second equation is 4 times 10, which is $40. For our last equation, we can add these two costs together to get our total cost. So 36 plus 40 equals M. Brilliant. We found our set of equations. Now that Ivy has new books to read, she will be participating in the Readathon. She has been tracking the minutes she reads. The first week, she read for 250 minutes. The second week, she read for twice the amount of the first week. The third week, she read for 190 minutes, and the fourth week she read for 235 minutes. We need to write an equation that can be used to find x, the total number of minutes she read this month. Since we are finding the total number of minutes, we will write these minutes as a sum in our equation. The first week was 250. The second week was twice that amount. So that is two groups of 250. The third was 190 and the fourth was a whopping 235. We make the sum equal to x, which represents our total number of minutes. And look at that, we have our equation. That is a total of 1175 minutes, which is approximately 19 and a half hours. Way to go, Ivy. Thanks for helping me represent multi-step problems with equations. That was almost as much fun as reading.